Hey y'all! Welcome back to my channel, Kentucky Fried Fun. Welcome if you are new, and welcome to day three of Shauna Ray's August Week of Cleaning Challenge. If you want to see me clean up my messy area underneath the stairs and see how I end up organizing it, stay tuned. Here is a look of it beforehand with all of the clothes and in the back I know it's really dark we do need to get some lighting and then in here is the dresser that I'm going to be using it we moved it out of our will be nursery in the drawers the first thing that I'm going to do like anytime I do a decluttering project is just going to take everything out of that room <laughs> If you are new to my channel, perhaps you're coming over from this challenge, my name is Ruth and on my channel you will find cleaning and declutter motivation as well as decoration inspiration. If you like that type of content, I would absolutely love it if you would subscribe. Then once you click that red subscribe button, be sure to also click that little bell right next to it so that you don't miss out on the final, my final day of cleaning this week. this is a participation with Shauna Ray's August week of cleaning collab I'll be sure to leave a link to the playlist of all the other ladies in their week of cleaning videos as well as Shauna Ray's channel up in the cards and down in the description box so that when you're finished watching my video you can head on over and get more cleaning motivation and here is a look of all of the stuff that came out of that room under the stairs. It is quite a lot. A majority of it is like our winter clothes and things like that that I need to go through this pile. I am going to declutter some of it, but first I'm going to go ahead and give the floor a good vacuum. Maybe we're I've given the floor a good vacuum and it's time to go through this pile of winter clothes, mainly like jackets, things like that, decide what I want to keep and divide it between what is mine and what is Michael's. I've been flying off the ceiling, taken by this feeling, baby we're invincible. You look at that. I said, my friend, what you're looking at? I think she is something for me. Excuse me, miss. It's my first time here. Maybe you can show me out of here. I think she got something in me. So please forgive my rudeness if I'm tripping over your time. But you look so amazing. And we over to this giant blue bin it isn't too full it mainly just has our like Halloween costumes that we like to wear to the Renaissance Festival and then like our hoodies from college so I'm just gonna go through and take things out and organize it you forgot something every good thing comes to an end at least it always happened to me I'm telling you this now, you don't need to worry. now I'm just going through this little white laundry basket that I had basically just been throwing stuff in that I knew I needed to go through later when I did this project. So much more. For 
several years now, I have for some reason been liking to use this duffel bag to store our shoes in that we're not wearing at the moment. So I'm just going to go through and put all of our boots in this bag and that way I don't have any loose boots or shoes in the room. And here are the results. As for now, there are still some things I would like to do in here. Very minimal. But I'm so happy to have all of that up and off the floor and into this dresser right here. And then over here in the corner, I just like to keep our suitcases right there nice and handy to just grab when we need them. And then here at the top of the dresser is just this bin that was given to me at our wedding shower that I have all of my purses in that I'm not using at the moment. On the top is our hats. And then there is a nice winter coat that I'll definitely be wearing this year. I just wasn't able to fit it in the drawers. This top drawer, one bin has Michael's like hats and gloves and the other bin has my hats and gloves. And I got both of these bins from Dollar Tree. They work perfectly fine. And then you'll see the drawer right underneath. I'm not able to pull it out because for some odd reason I was unable to get these drawers fully in. I'll have Michael help me with that. But that does have like Michael's hoodies. And then this next one also I believe has Michael's hoodies as well. And then there's two more that have my outerwear clothes. And here I'm just showing how I will need to put that one and get that fixed. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope that you were able to get some declutter motivation from it. If you did, please be sure to leave it a big thumbs up. Be sure you are subscribed. Have your little bell click so that you don't miss out on my fourth cleaning video tomorrow. I will see you all tomorrow.